What is up guys, it is Bomb Squad and we are back again on Madam Mobile and today I'm going to be showing you the best plays to use in league tournament play. Um, if you guys are have played a league tournament yet and you guys would know exactly what I mean, um, it's really really hard, like it's nothing like head to head in season play. Um, I don't know really why it's this hard, it just is, like you fumble more often, you throw more interceptions. The plays get countered more often. I have no idea why. It's just how it is. Um, so if you guys haven't done that, go and play a league tournament and tell me how it is. It's really hard. But today I'm going to be showing you some plays that will help your you and your whole league by itself to, by getting you like at least a 20 in a league tournament. So today I'm going to be playing, uh, let's just play, I guess, this king guy. 67 defense I think I have a yeah I have a 63 offense so don't say my team's better here I'll just show you my team just in case and I will tell you what you need to do before um, my tips are I bought three players all less than 3,000 coins combined three players they are at halfback I have Orleans Darkwa 67 overall I got him for 700 coins he has 88 speed 83 acceleration and 80 trucking and I also got EJ Manuel. Uh, he was a thousand coins, and um, he has 80 speed, 79 acceleration, 85 throw power. And the last pickup I got was um, Derek Carrier. He was also a thousand coins as well. He has 84 speed, which is really good for a tight end. 83 acceleration, and uh, he's got a decent run block. I mean, 66 isn't too bad. But anyways, guys. That's the only three players I picked up. The only reason, because that's the only players I use mostly. And yeah, 3,000 coins. I'm pretty sure you guys can get that right away. If you haven't, go watch my last video. It's an easy way to pick up that that sort of amount of coins. And um, yeah, guys, so let's hop into the league play here. We have um, three drives to use, and I'll show you the plays that work very, very well. So here we go. Let's see what I can get in this one so return middle of course you're not gonna want to do one side but um, the best thing I like to do is as soon as you are about to get tackled like double tap the skills button and you'll spin move and that's the best way of avoiding getting uh, uh, avoiding to get uh, to fumble so um, here we go the first play I think I'm gonna run this strong IHP blast it seems a it's a really good play I mean most people use it but you just want to run to the outside and then truck and there's a first down right there and a uh, pass play that's good is HP screen you want to go out to the right a little bit and run back and wait for your halfback to get open there he is and now he's just gonna run up the field with all that space as it's not a first down but it's also a really good play um, another one that works really good is this weak eye HP gut. That's good for short yardage and two point conversions. Always the best thing is to go to the sidelines because in case you fumble, there's a minimum chance you fumble, but um, just in case you want it to go out of bounds. Um, C678 is a very commonly used play, but I usually save that till later. A good pass play is this bunch PA dig, um, as you'll see me run this a lot. Oh my god, I just nailed this wide receiver every time, wide open, and it works every time. So I'm going to go back to this strong IHP blast play. Um, it's just a really good play, as that one was countered, but as you see what I did there, guys, if it's countered, what you want to do is don't, like keep tapping the skills button and go right up the middle. That is your best chance of avoiding getting tackled in the backfield, and it just works really, really well. So HP blast here, that didn't work really good at all. That's something you don't want to do is run backwards, but I thought it would work there. So I think we're going to go back to HP screen and see if we can get a uh, touchdown here. And you just wait, 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 and throw it there. And look at all the space. Look at all the space. And there it is. That's a touchdown. That is an easy touchdown. And then two-point conversions are really hard. So what I like to do is strong eye HP, blat or HP toss. And usually the block... Uh, they block really well and there you go you just truck one guy most of the time you don't have to truck but there had to so there's eight and we still got two more drives as you can see I used a wide variety of plays 
and that's what I don't get about the countering system yet, like how it was just countered out of nowhere, but every time I used it again, it wasn't. Like, right there it was countered, but the first one I used, it wasn't countered. I think that's why people are dropping a lot of drives, so I'm going to play this guy again. Um, this might be a little bit longer of a video, but I'm hoping this does show you some plays and help you out in league tournament play, guys, because it's really helping me get me uh, get me some good uh, some good points in this. So here we go. We're gonna kick off, and you'll never get a good uh, kick return for a touchdown because they're not fast enough. See, I just did a spin move, so I avoided getting a fumble. But uh, I'm not gonna use seam six, seven, eight quite yet because it's really risky. So I'm just going to use strong eye twins and this one you can punch out to the outside and there we go. There's a hole. You want to go to the sidelines and go right up but not fast enough. I think his safeties probably have some good speed on them. So we're going to use HB screen and after this I'll show you a play that don't ever use until you have a good tight end. And there that's one of the times HB screen doesn't work very well but now I'm going to go back to my favorite play bunch A, bunch PA dig very good play because the route oh that one's but I see fells right in the middle there good find so it's third down and short what I like to do is go out a shotgun no it's not shot it's eye form and do curls it's a good play um, works pretty well Richardson right there and then try and get to the sidelines and run them up but curls is a really good one for uh, really short yardage because he just exposes the crap out of the cornerback but uh, let's go with a HB Blast. I would avoid any, that HB Toss one I used for two point guys, avoid using that on the middle of your drive because it's not really that good. As I just escaped two tackles and there we go, another touchdown. But I'm gonna use HP Toss here, or Strong Toss, I don't know. I'm just so used to last season where I called it HB Toss. Ooh, that's countered, but. Oh, sh Nikes, I didn't get it, guys. Dang. <laughs> Well, it's still only two points, but so I think that was countered, actually, matter of fact. Yeah, it was countered. See, I can't really do anything about that. I don't know. That's why I don't understand this at all. The countering system is so messed up. Like, it wasn't countered before, but now it is. It just doesn't make any sense. But, um, we got one more drive left. Uh, I know not to do my favorite play anymore for my two-point conversion, but... Avoid doing Hail Mary, guys. Another one. Do not do that. It's always going to get picked off. Like, not always, but a majority of the time, it's going to get picked off. And it just ticks me off because that's kind of how you're going to drop drives. And this one actually might be a touchdown, but he's not fast enough. Oh, I got... Oh, looks like I just got an achievement for that. For rushing for 15 yards on that play. Back to PA, bunch dig. As long as you... Oh, that's key. Uh, I don't know why I said Keith. I'm just getting it from MMG. Sorry. It's just something I pick up from watching his videos. But HP screen here. Hoping this works out very well. Because if it doesn't, I'm kind of screwed. Come on, get your blocks. There we go. Oh, shoot. Okay. So then here we go. Third and long. Seam 6, 7, 8. You want to throw it to your tight end. No one else, guys. Hit it to the tight end. Make him in the inside. And there we go. That's a catch. You want him to be in the inside of the cornerback, if that makes sense. Because if he's on the other side, there's a, about an 85% chance it's going to get picked off. And it doesn't end well because you get really mad. But uh, let's do HP Blast here and see if we can punch this out to the outside here. Um, yeah, we can. But no one's holding their blocks long enough to keep me going. But as we're ending up this drive... Um, let's do something like, um, what do we got left? Uh, what play haven't I used yet? Slants is decent, it might get picked off, but motion cross is good as well. Um, you just want to hit one of these guys on the left side of the screen. It fells. There you go. Oh my god, nice catch, dude. Great, great catch. Whatever, that happens sometimes when your team is so bad like mine, but that's going to be a touchdown if this guy can block. No, he can't, and it's still a touchdown because I trucked him, but um, let's see, what can we use? I know HP Blast is going to be countered, and so is Toss. Um, this PA Drag is decent. I mean, don't I want to trust it, but it's not too bad. I'm going to go with this, uh, this gut play. This works too. 
and you're just gonna write it right up the gut just like it says and there you go guys that is a 22 that should help out your league just good enough guys um, very simple those are the plays I like to use all the time and those are the ones I suggest for you guys to use so hope this video did help you out if it did go leave a comment down below in this video and let me know if this helped you out because I really would like that and uh, leave a like on the video if you guys enjoyed it and until then I'll see you in the next video peace